I bought this container on the flea market the other day when I was there. I don't know what it was used to be or um, surely they used it to, to paint something. But I think it looked pretty. And with the red geraniums it will look very good. So I have potted on these kohlrabi seedlings, except of these two, they were already in pots. And then here is cauliflower, broccoli and the white cabbage I had to re -sew. I have, no sorry, this is the white cabbage, this row. And the second row is uh, Brussels sprouts. The white cabbage, uh, well, it didn't fail, it just got drowned in water, <laughs> but that's how it is, so I have re -sewn it again. And this is cauliflower, and from here this is the broccoli, so the broccoli is uh, bigger than the cauliflower. And these are the older ones, one, two, three. Uh, cauliflower that has survived from the first sowing and this is also broccoli. All of it. Lots of broccoli. These two I'm not too sure it's either cauliflower or broccoli. I didn't label them so that's a mistake. And this is the French marigold, the whole lot. And uh, this is bought from the shop. This here is the rest of the kohlrabi. I have uh, uh, potted on today, and and this here is white cabbage. The second uh, sowings. Over there is one uh, zucchini. It didn't grow as well like the other two I have indoors right now. And this I bought in the shop as well. These two dahlias, they look fine, and I have another two pots, and I told you last time, there is no life, but I think, finally, at least in the big pot, I can see one. And the sweet peas, no, they're not happy. That is a new one, and these are the new ones. But the old ones, they just stopped growing and they look a bit yellow. And I do feed them. I mean, there's plenty of roots. But anyways. And here I've got a few cosmos. They're becoming a bit leggy, but uh, I think they, they will be fine. In London I had them very leggy too and then they did well. Yeah, and I still don't know what exactly it is. It's surely something to to uh, screw it down, to hold it tight. This here is not very sharp, so it's not something to cut. But yeah, hmm. So they forecast more frost tonight, the coming night, so they will stay indoors. My tomato seedlings, they go a bit leggy now, but not too bad. Nothing compared to the leggy tomatoes I had back in London. They would be double the size now. And here are two courgettes. They want to flower now. Pepper. And all the cucumbers again. Then here's the basil. And more pepper and these ones are the uh, yellow chili. And here the fusalis are quite big now. They like it here. And here we have three honey nut and three butternut. Because of the state of the cucumbers, I have zone again two of each variety. 
these two and these two. Just in case if they are not doing anything. Somebody suggested to take off the flowers and the cucumbers, but I think I'll just leave it for now. I mean, nothing will come out of these anyways. But yeah, hopefully in about two weeks I can put these out. I mean, the tomatoes at least, and the uh, courgette as well, I hope. Yep.